welcome to our channel Palander Tips. In this tutorial, as you will learn that how we can create this beautiful water follow path simulation using Blender without using the fluid physics properties like our domain and flow object. And uh, here you can also learn that I create this beautiful simulation by adding a just curve and a particle properties to this system. So how we can create this? simulation so let's start first i open the blender then press shift a to add a curve type which is curve profile and here i select the hylex and uh, open this panel and here i increase the end angle up to one thousands and uh, also increase the width and height of this curve something like this beautiful now select this vertex of this curve and then press shift s and here i select the cursor to select it nice now back to the object mode and uh, then again press shift a here i add the uh, uv sphere and scale it down something like this and also make it shade smooth then again press shift a and here now i add a meta ball and uh, scale it down and move it something like here now select the curve and uh, here in physics i choose the force field and here the type of the force field i select the curve guide beautiful now select this sphere and here in particle uh, i add a particle system and uh, if i run this then you can see that the particles are emitted from the sphere and follow the curve beautiful now i set the particle setting and here in render i select the object and here i select this meta ball and uh, now you can see that there is no uh, particle visible on this curve because the scale of the particle is too much small for that i increase the scale value something like this beautiful and also scale nice now it's look some better beautiful now i run the simulation and check the result nice and uh, here i reduce this animation up to 100 frame and uh, here in particle setting i decrease the end of the particles is 50 frame and uh, nice now if you run the simulation then you can see that it's look like a very beautiful follow path water simulation nice now it's time to add material and uh, i also in render i cannot see this object emitting object in show emitter and i Deselect this option in render. Beautiful. And now it's time to apply the material. So for material, I enter into the my material panel. And uh, in material panel, I select this and uh, also enter into the rendered view. And here I hit the new button and I Diesel and delete this principal BSDF and by pressing shift A I add the 
some glass bsdf type material beautiful now in word properties i delete my this hdri and here in environmental texture i select the sky textures beautiful now you can see that in layout and in rendered you can see that our perfect water simulation follow path is ready thanks for watching